It's a sticky little thing called a fact. Tens of millions of dollars that the Trump campaign continuously says Donald Trump has given away without specifically providing any of the sticky little facts to back it all up. Anyone who knows about Donald Trump and his career knows that this is a man who's given away tens of millions of dollars to charitable causes. Joining us now is Trump's campaign manager, Kellyanne Conway. Kellyanne, this morning on here. CNN's yeah. New Day, it was Trump's campaign there. manager's turn campaign to dodge the question. Well. Part of why people are calling for him to release his taxes is so that we do know how much he himself has given to charity. Will you or the campaign release exactly what that number is? And I the reason it. I ask, why would you doubt it? I doubt it because this is like badgering. In other words, I don't see it as journalism. I see it as badgering. Here is the journalism as we know it pulled from the Donald J. Trump Foundation's own tax filings. The first thing you will notice is the foundation is relatively small. In 2014, it had just $1.3 million in the bank. And Donald Trump hasn't given any money to his foundation since 2008. The foundation receives donations from people who seem to do business or sponsor TV appearances with Donald Trump. NBC, Comedy Central, the World Wrestling Entertainment. And Trump uses that donated money to donate in his name. The Washington Post, which has done an exhaustive review of Trump's giving, reported that a $10,000 donation Trump's foundation says it gave to the Latino Commission on AIDS was never received. Today, the director of the Latino Commission on AIDS told us the same thing then, actually checked and changed his story. It turns out Trump did give $10,000, gratefully received. I'm grateful that the story came up because I was able to clarify the confusion that happened when they were uh, putting this story together. In a second instance, the Washington Post reported that Trump's foundation failed to give a $10,000 donation to the Giving Back Fund, a fund devoted to professional athletes' charitable causes. It turns out Trump, in fact, did give money there, too. We just did an exhaustive search, the charity wrote to CNN, and did finally find a record of it. Trump apparently made the donation to the charity's Ben Roethlisberger Foundation, not to the foundation itself. Aaron, we just found another inconsistency just within the last hour that bolsters Donald Trump's claim he's being attacked unfairly. The Trump Foundation's tax form showed that it gave $1,000 to a group called Friends of Veterans in Vermont. The Post report said it didn't receive that donation. Well, we checked, and a Florida charity with the same name did get the 1000 bucks in 2013. That looks like a case of sloppiness on the Trump Foundation's part. We contacted the Washington Post with what we found. They say they weren't any in inaccuracies or inconsistencies in their story, but they have since updated the story on their website. This is only going to feed, Aaron, into the pushback we're getting from the Trump campaign, that reporting on Trump's charitable contributions are filled with inaccuracies. Today again, though, we have asked and repeatedly asked over and over again, where are the specifics on these tens of millions of dollars supposedly donated? We haven't gotten an answer.